Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Fighting Game Freak Out. Today, we are playing SVC Chaos. Now, I just did the um, serious Mr. Karate Not Boss Rage a couple months ago. But, you know what? For the February season, I decided to take on one of the real final bosses of the game. Um, because there are... Uh, four bosses you can fight, uh, those being Shinokuma and Serious Mr. Karate for just playing the game and having certain characters show up. But then there are two secret bosses, which are Goddess Athena and today's subject, Red Aramur. Now, I wanted to fight him for Halloween, but uh, seeing how my other candidate was dizzy, I was like, you know what? I don't want to overuse Guilty Gear, so I moved this guy all the way up to February, and plus, I want to get SVC Chaos out of my life. So anyway... Uh, we're going to be fighting Red Armor. The difficulty is on level 8. And um, this is one of those bosses where you only get one try. So I will have to be abusing save states just to keep the format alive. But in actual circumstances, I probably would not be able to beat this boss unless by pure absolute fluke. So there you go. But this is just a battle of attrition. So there you go. It has been a while since I've formally recorded a, a fighting game freakout. Ever since 2016. Like, it's insanity. Can you amuse me more than a Taiga? Anyway, I'm also going to be playing as Sagat for this run. Because not only have we fought him before, but also... Fuck. Yeah, not only have we uh, fought Sagat as a boss before on this show, but... Uh, I'm pretty okay with Sagat. Really, the zombie fuck. See, this is my problem with Red Arrow. He's... He is the fucking legend of zombie. Like... He just... He spams shit the whole time. Alright, so that block attack is an overhead. Oh my god. Alright, fuck. I'm gonna get into damage. God damn it! Okay. Yeah, so you turn into this ogre thing, he, he yells at you, and then you get the bad ending. So, there you go. <laughs> so the requirements are that you can't lose before um, Shinakuma or Serious Mr. Karate. Once you get to them, you're pretty much good, as they're so cheap to the point where, you know, fuck. Alright, when he's floating, you have to do this game. Oh, never mind. That attack is straight unblockable. Okay. So the rush attack is completely unavoidable. What? what? How did he get a red S? What? Does that mean, does mean like it's a cheese victory? Oh, there's running. That's SMK. Right. This is SMK logic. Although, technically, this is a Capcom boss, which I guess would be a nice send up for the um, son of a bitch. Which would be a nice send-up for uh, God Google, which was a, an SNK boss in a Capcom developed game. Alright. I'm just trying to get close to this motherfucker. Just trying to get close to this motherfucker, but I can't do it. No! Damn it, I was trying to get the exceed. Motherfucker. Alright, so once Sagat turns into an ogre, that's when I need to load the stage. Oh. Fuck. Why does it do so much damage? God damn it, I knew that was gonna happen. Yeah, that was actually a nice tiger cannon. Oh, son of a fuck. No, I. There you go, that shit is easy to punish. Provided there aren't fucking ghouls in the goddamn sky. No! Mashed out fireball. God damn it. 
Now, in later revisions of SVC Chaos, you could actually play as this asshole. Which, I, oh my god, they're, he, he's like, he's like Frodo Magaki. Like, I think this is what gave, uh, Capcom, or not Capcom, SMK, um, the inspiration to make Magaki is, fuck! To make Magaki as cheap as he is, because uh, Magaki's cheap as fuck for pretty much the exact same reason that Red Arrow is cheap in this game. Okay, confirmed. The worst bit is the goddamn dive attack. So basically, you're getting whittled away with chip damage. Oh my God, Sagai! Couldn't have been bothered to dash right there. Fuck. Yeah! There we go! Amazing job. Try again, kid. Alright, so all we gotta do is land and exceed when he's on low health, and then we're good. So, yeah. Nope! Nope! Oh, fuck you. Oh, was that the fucking... Was that the fucking exploit you told me about? Was that it? I don't know, there's some bug involving Red Armor. No, the zombie! God damn it! I would've been stuck in chip damage for six hours. I might actually not need exceed. Not as hard as I think he is. Son of a bitch. Ah! Come on! Come on! Yeah! There we go! What the fuck? Who's this guy? Who'd have thought it? Red Arma defeated. But this is the Netherworld. Someone like you has no place here. Yeehaw! Huh, the world's mightiest. I pined for it so, and now, I feel so hollow inside. Why? Lord Sagat. Members of Shavalu, from, from here on, you lead all in Shavalu. What bid you? How boring. Leave that nonsense to Balrog. Lord, where do you go? Sagat returning to Thailand resumed his vigorous training. Ryu, come and get me if you can climb this high. So Sagat is on a revenge plot to get to. F so basically, Sagat's just doing his traditional story of wanting to face off against Ryu, but then he goes. Like Zangi, he he pulls the Zangi move by training on an animal that, in his case, a tiger. What the fuck? Why would he like? Ugh, I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, that was a pretty easy clear of um, um red armor. That only took me eight minutes. Jesus Christ. Uh, maybe at one point or another, I may want to do a video against um Goddess Athena which I may actually be able to get to legit. The problem is, is that I would have to save on her. K-Natsui nuts. <laughs> Alright, there you go. There you go. Thank you for playing! There you go. There you go. Yeah. I, I'm gonna name myself Boo, because... Quite frankly, that was kind of disappointing, but, you know. Game over! Game over! <laughs> there you go. Anyway, let's go to the soft dip. Level 8 difficulty. I was playing on level 8 difficulty. Uh, no camera tricks, no anything. That was hardest difficulty. And honestly, Red Armor is a pretty fair challenge, I do say. Um, never mind, I made this harder than I thought it was going to be. Um, definitely the hardest bit to get it. Like, definitely the worst bit is that you only get one try. That's probably the only reason they'd be hard. But there you go, first true FGF of the year. Uh, General's Last Stand was kind of made just as a buffer 
because I couldn't really do much, and then getting over it just kind of happened. But I did try for uh, uh, Dark Ash and Psyche, so there you go. But anyway, uh, there we go. So maybe I'll re-challenge this game one day. Maybe I might do a um, joint, not boss rage, of Shinakuma and Goddess Athena. But for now, I think that for the first real FGF of 2018, we're doing pretty good. We're chilling. There you go. So anyway, I'll see you all next time. Only you can prevent forest fires.